In this video, I will show you how to crochet single crochet. Today, we're going to be working with our Jersey Be Good yarn in the Jog Grey colorway and one of our 12 millimeter silver crochet hooks. Let's get started. Once you've worked your foundation chain, chain one additional stitch. This is your turning chain and you must work this step at the beginning of every row. You're going to work your first single crochet stitch into the second chain from the hook. Remember, don't count the loop on your hook. You're not going to go into this one, you're going to go into this one. So take your hook and push the end of it through that stitch, like so. So you can now count two loops on your hook. Take your yarn over your hook and use the end of your hook to pull it through just this loop, like so. You should now be able to count two loops on your hook. To complete your single crochet stitch, take the yarn over your hook once more and then use the end of your hook to draw it through both of those remaining loops, like so. You've now completed your first single crochet stitch. So you're going to repeat those steps working into each stitch along your foundation chain in turn. So let's, let's do the next one. So insert your hook into the next stitch, yarn over your hook and bring it through just that first stitch. Yarn over your hook again and bring it through the remaining two loops on your hook. So you've now worked your second single crochet stitch. This is your next stitch here which you're going to work into, so insert your hook, yarn over your hook, bring it through that first loop, yarn over your hook again and bring it through the remaining two. So I'm just going to repeat these steps to work to the end of my foundation chain. So now you've reached the end of your foundation chain. This is what your work should look like after you've worked one row of single crochet into the foundation chain. Now I'm going to show you what it looks like when you work the next row, so working on top of a row of stitches. So as you did at the start of this first row, you're going to chain one stitch, and this is your turning chain. And remember to always do that before you start a new row of single crochet. You're going to turn your work around, and now you're going to work back across your row. So remembering to skip that turning chain, you're going to work your first single crochet stitch of the row into the second stitch from the hook. So not this one, you're going to go in here. So insert your hook. And as you're going through a stitch, it now looks like you've got two strands here, but just think of that as one, one stitch. You're going to repeat the same steps as you did on your first row by taking your yarn over your hook, bringing it through the first stitch, yarn over your hook again, bring it through the two remaining loops, like so. And you're now going to work back across your row, working each stitch in turn, repeating the same steps. So your next stitch is here. Insert your hook, take your yarn over your hook, bring it through the first loop, yarn over your hook, bring it through both. Insert your hook, yarn over the hook and bring it through, yarn over the hook again, bring it through both. So once you've reached the end of your second row of single crochet, your piece should look something like this. So you're now just going to work a turning chain before you start back across your next row. And you're just going to keep on repeating these steps to continue working in single crochet.